Short sale information. Short sale specialist Mike Rickley discusses Wells Fargo FHA short sale. Looking for short sale information? You've come to the right place. Mike Rickley, certified default advocate, distressed property expert, and your short sale specialist here. Thanks for joining us. Hey, today let's talk about a recent Wells Fargo FHA short sale we're involved in. Okay, this could be a rant, but let's talk about it. This is a particularly frustrating short sale flare for us. It's a nasty divorce where Mr. Seller won't cooperate short of a court order and Wells Fargo, the absolutely most anal retentive of all the banks, is the servicer and FHA is the investor. Talk about a perfect storm for frustration, to be kind. Now, we've been working this short sale for months. After chasing paperwork from the reluctant Mr. Seller, we finally received our authorization to participate from FHA. Good news, right? You would think so. We already had an offer that exceeded FHA's net requirement, and all Wells Fargo had to do was approve the offer. After 30 plus days of promises and mis misinformation, the negotiator at Wells Fargo finally admitted the file had been sitting with no one looking at it the whole time. Never mind the fact that we were getting twice weekly responses to our inquiries to the contrary that somebody was working on it. That's bogus. Well, you know, we never take no for an answer, and so once we got to the truth, we escalated the file to Wells Fargo senior management. Good news, bad news. The good news is that we got the file moving forward. The bad news is, is we truly pissed off the negotiator and he started asking for redundant documents and closed the file for non-response with his unrealist, unrealist, uh, unrealistic tight time frames. Normally, we can make the unreal, unrealistic request work, but in this case where we had to go through two different attorneys involved just to get one form signed, we couldn't make it happen fast enough as hard as we tried. Now. Here's what it is, is after Wells Fargo sitting on the file for better than 30 days with no activity, we're having to escalate the file to Wells Fargo and directly to FHA. What a waste of taxpayer dollars uh, over the poor performance of one bitter Wells Fargo marginally competent employee. That's harsh, but really, he let our file sit for 30 days and lied to us. Naturally, being used to agents who roll over for this kind of, of well, pardon my friends, crap, I'm sure that that negotiator didn't think we would take, take our case directly to FHA HUD or to his senior management. And I don't think he's expecting the consequences that are going to go with that kind of exposure. In the end, we're going to get the short sale approved in spite of our negotiator and we will save this family from foreclosure. It will take us a little longer than usual and as they say, no hill's too high for a climber. We won't let one individual stop this family from starting fresh financially. Now. Is a short sale right for you? I don't know. Give me a call. Let's talk about it. Do you need a short sale specialist that's willing to go to the mat for you? Absolutely. Give me the call. I'm your guy. To get a better idea of when your home will be worth what you owe, log on to www.shortsaleandloanmod.info for a free estimate. Call me today. Let's talk about your particular situation. The advice is free. The report is free. Listen. Call me today. You'll sleep better tonight. You'll be glad you did. And thanks for joining us.